I'm Katie, I made it, I said it, I ate it. You heard me. I am from New Orleans, Louisiana, and I'm a bounce artist, AKA the legendary Katie Ray, iconic. I was known to be the first transgender slash homosexual rapper, bounce artist. That is Miss Katie Red, a legendary bounce artist who's been doing it for over 20 years. But before we get to her story, what exactly is bounce? People may call it twerking. The correct name for it is bouncing. Shake your ass music, that's a bounce music, you shake your ass music. The origin of bounce music can be traced back to the mid 80s, to a DJ duo from Queens known as the Showboys. They took the theme from Dragnet and sampled it into this. Eventually, it made its way to New Orleans where the beat got sped up, looped, and by the early 90s, Bounce was a mainstay in New Orleans music. Soon enough, Bounce went from a hyper-local New Orleans sound to influencing some of mainstream's biggest artists like Drake and Beyonce. I don't know what it is about that sound. But whatever that sound be, and have you moving to your feet, baby. My first concert, I was scared. I was, I was scared. I was so nervous. Soon I got up there and I was like, you know, how y'all doing? So like, and they were screaming out loud and like, we love you, we love your music. I'm like, oh, I'm like, that was like, what a big relief. It takes a certain amount of brashness and bravado to make it as a bounce artist, let alone as an openly gay or transgender one. But Katie is not one to shy away from anything. Me opening doors for a lot of bounce artists and a lot of gay artists, I, I think about that a lot. The bounce scene is more accepting, but at first it wasn't. I was bold and brave, but at the same time I was scared, but I still had to do me. A lot of gay guys walk up to me and say, Katie, okay, you're the reason I told my mom I was gay, because I was like, I listen to your music. I made people be who they are and who they really want to be. You only get one life, and nobody can run your life but you. Yeah. 